This is a Steam Greenlight trailer for Pat Logic. It's a game about some little square, I think. So here's the main menu. Uh, that's always good for a trailer, as is the Adobe Flash Player uh, overlay there. Really lets you know that, uh, the, okay, no. Can the trailer stay, can the trailer stay still for a moment? <laughs> right, it's already hard to make out the words because of all the different colors and sizes of the letters. Like, that's just annoying. Uh, but the fact the game won't just calm down and, oh well, I mean, it, it has calmed down now and it's staying on a screen, but it's just the menu. No, no, it's swips. What is, the, who makes a trailer like this? It doesn't help that the music itself resets every time you flip a screen. Like, that's just a mess. What's that? I don't know what that is. Oh, some actual gameplay's arrived. That's nice. And it's... Well... Uh, there it is. There it goes, sliding down. Uh-huh. Not exactly worth waiting for, is it? I mean, it's not... It, well, it's not good, but it's... Oh, we're, we're back to, oh yeah, definitely back to flipping around on the screens again. Because that, that's coherent. And then, that's the end of the trailer. Description. Pat Logic is a game where you need to lead main hero to the goal by providing him with the clear path where you touch, click on the bricks, making them to break on the way to his goal. Yep. Pat Logic in total has 30 levels, continuous soundtrack, fun, and fast gameplay. Use mouse, left click, or touch for UI and actual gameplay. So you break blocks and let the, the square get to the, the goal, which is handily marked out by the letters G-O-A-L, which spells goal. Okay, yeah. Uh, like I said, the game doesn't look great or, or even good. It doesn't look terrible. There's way, way worse games we've covered. But that was one of the worst trailers I've ever watched. That has 100% not sold me on the game, because if you can't even, if you can't put together a decent or even watchable opening presentation, you know, this is the world's first look at your game, and if you can't even come close to nailing it, how am I going to think the game itself is worth a shit? Now, I'm not asking you to be fucking, you know, the Del Toro of, of, trailer editing you know you don't have to be a great editor to do a decent video i should fucking know but i mean come on what was that flip in between the menus and the credits and and the, the level select screen which is one of the most horrific visually nauseating level select screen screens i've ever seen I mean, what was that all that flipping back and forth before we got to any actual gameplay with the music switches in between, that was awful. Like, that was a distinctly horrible, frustrating, like, skin-crawlingly frustrating viewing experience. And you shouldn't do it. I mean, you know, I'm, I'm sorry if that's not a, a, a critical enough for you, but, but don't do that. Please don't do that. As for the game itself, gameplay, not particularly remarkable. You know, click a block, make it disappear so the square can hit the squares. That's fine. But, Jesus Christ, can you uh, maybe change the the visuals? Um, I'm not even talking about in terms of quality, although you could certainly stand to get an artist. But the mash of colours, just the, the car crash of, of colour and shape is just horrible it's horrible uh, i feel like this game would look a lot better and have a lot more traction if you really got some like artistic cohesion together or, or, or just some artistry uh, in the the visual design graphics aren't everything but when they make your game look just distinctly unpleasant to look at uh, you might want to to look into that and then maybe fix that so yeah uh, get a way better trailer, the one one that just focuses p purely on gameplay and not something that's just flipping left and right like you're a fucking Tinder profile or something. Like, let's just tighten it up, please.